Hey, Yuri. I'm heading to the Bowery to make sure Michaels gets to his new safe house. You know, safely. I wouldn't do that. Silver Sable made it clear you are not welcome. Yeah, well, what's she gonna do? Shoot me? Honestly, 50-50 chance. Ah, uh, fine. We're ready for you, Dr. Michaels. Is that the Devil's Breath? It's called GR-27, not... <sighs> Just be careful. In the wrong hands, this could... Don't worry. We're the best in the world. <sighs> I feel better already. Code 381. Package is on the move. This way, Dr. Michaels. What the hell is that? Welcome aboard, Doctor. Get off me! We got this! Yeah, sure you do. Pursuit of Martin Lee. I think he's got Dr. Michaels and the Devil's Breath. Copy that. Four units coming your way. He took Michaels alive, so that's good. Probably so we can force him to make more Devil's Breath. I have to stop that truck. A tank. Whatever. Clear the guys in the trucks before I go after Lee. Coming, and he will destroy all sinners! Sorry! Lee, hand it over!
What's your status? Have you apprehended Lee? Working on it! I'll take this! What are you doing to me? Giving you a new perspective. Must be honest. I was hoping to bring you here. My abilities lend me a certain persuasiveness. I've been watching you. I was waiting for you at City Hall. You never came. Where were you? This is real or in my mind. It was a shame so many had to die with no heroes to save them. That officer saved your life, didn't he? He was here because of you. Norman wanted to use him. A futile gesture, in the end. And where was Norman during all this? Slinking at me like a rat. He knew what was going to happen, and he fled. Norman is a hidden cancer on this city. He must be excised with no trace of his corruption to return. Norman hides behind his mask of lies. I will break it apart and drag him into the light. Put on the mask. Become one of us. Thanks, but no thanks! <sighs> one way or the other, you will join me. Uh-oh. All the souls you've lost. The innocent victims you couldn't save. Martin, their blood is on your hands! You can stop Osborne. You have so much strength. I can give you will. Their bodies filled the gutters, and you did nothing. I can't see everyone. What's one life? Simple trade. One life for a city of souls. You defend Osborne while he sits in his ivory tower? This isn't real. Show me your true strength.
How worried should I be? Very. You're a popular guy. Where is this serum? I'm gone. The Discoya. So-called superhero. You think you save people, but you just make it worse. This is your fault. My fault? He was under your protection. Do you really need two of those? <laughs> Stop! We need to brief Mr. Osborne now. I'll go with her. Thank you. I'll remember this. I'm flying pretty close to blind. Ought to look for towers to activate. Yuri, tell me you've got a lead on Martin Lee's location. We have footage from a guy at a coffee shop. Looks like he hopped into a black sedan after the crash. Black sedan, great. Let me finish. We have a partial plate. And one of my patrol guys just found a matching plate. Sedan in a parking lot near Canal and Hudson. You're a good cop, Yuri. I'm on my way. Spider-Man. Hello? Is this working? Dr. Michaels? How are you calling? Borrowed one of Sable's radios. Listen, transit hubs are the most likely release points for Devil's Breath. Airports, bus terminals, train stations. It'll spread like wildfire from there. Why the hell is Oscorp developing a bioweapon in the city? Shouldn't this be in an arctic bunker? Devil's Breath is personal for Norman. It's been his obsession for decades. The project breaks every state and federal regulation on the books, but he doesn't care. If the city finds out, he can kiss re-election goodbye. Never mind re-election. He'd be tried in The Hague for war crimes. Why are you telling me all this? Aren't you just as culpable as Norman? Yes. Project's risk for too long. I trust you, Spider-Man. You're the only one trying to do the right thing. Please, protect the city from our mistakes.